Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It is episode 24, and we're continuing our playthrough of Portal. We've been making our way through the old 1950s, 1960s testing chambers with the beautifully um, era-appropriate buttons and stuff. Uh, I do like the attention to detail and keeping it as close to uh, as it could be for that time period if there were an aperture science and they still had uh, uh, portal guns as such, although it looked a lot more like a backpack than anything else. And um, Cave Johnson showing his complete and utter disrespect for people and anything because science. Um, probably shouldn't have come down here. Oh, maybe I can cr crawl across these guys. I see anywhere that I should be shooting a portal. Okay, that doesn't work. Um, I need to get up there. All right, let's let's see if this is enough to uh, safely get us across. And there we go. Oh, oh, here we go. Limited selection of portal spots. So that's going to give us the opportunity to launch into a wall. Yeah. Into a wall. Oh. Okay. Nope, that doesn't go across there. What else we got? Nothing on the floor. Not much going there. Uh, we got something up here, though. Is that where I need to go? Yeah, that looks like it's where I need to go. So, let's, uh, like a so. And like I a so. I like your style. You make up your own rules, just like me. Bean counter said I should <laughs> fire a man just for being in a wheelchair. Did it anyway. Ramps are expensive. <laughs> wow. Alright. What's gonna drop? Oh! Oh. be what I wanted either. Uh, oh. Let's try this again. Let's go up and up. And whoop. oh wait, why am I doing this the hard way? Hmm. Let's go orange and then blue. Is this going to be enough to launch me across? Oh. And 
Nope. Nah, it looks like a whole lot of death down there, too. Alright, um... Hmm... I need... More momentum? Oh, no, I know what I need. I know what I need. Okay, okay, okay. Again. Let's get that targeted right there. Walk around this guy and start coating that area with the bubble. With the repulsion gel. Let's uh, try to get as much of it as we can over there. About all we can. Okay. So that is the blue. And we'll get the orange. And oh, kill our momentum. Try this one more time. With feeling. Oh. Ooh. And heads up that oh. coffee we gave you earlier Good. had fluorescent calcium in it so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. Um. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself um. thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. Come on, man. That's like saying don't think of pink elephants. You're thinking of pink elephants, aren't you? Alright. Where is this one going? Nineteen fifty-eight. So we must be getting to newer chambers. Now, if you're we part of Control to... Group Kepler Seven, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely, you've forgotten it's even there. <laughs> but if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know, because that means it's about to hit five hundred degrees. So we're going to need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Okay. That. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. This will only go on here. And it looks like the water washes that off. But we still gotta find a way to bounce across.
Oh. Well, okay then. Uh, that's not how that's gonna go. Um. Hmm. That didn't work out so well. What am I missing? I am missing something over here. Oh. Oh. Let's, uh... Get some more of this stuff over here. Alright. Okay. This next <laughs> test may involve trace amounts of time travel. So, word of advice, <laughs> if you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Lab boys tell me that'll wipe out time. Entirely. <laughs> Forward and backward. So, do both of yourselves a favor and just let that handsome devil go about his business. <laughs> Remember, if you're... If a future you tries to warn you about this test, don't listen. Okay. Okay, so that yeah. That help me? Not really. Does that help me? No. Okay. So let's do this. And go blue. Bounce. Done. Not done. I sure do love their pneumatic tubes. Take me right anywhere useful. <laughs> I keep trying to crouch walk like that's going to keep me from fall falling off. This isn't Minecraft. Alright, nope. That's just the big way through there. So, this has got to be... Through here. Alright.
Or is this simpler? Am I overthinking it? Let's see. If... No, okay. Um, here. Let's try this. Let's go like this. And that should push us into that pylon there. And then we'll see what options that opens up. Oh. Alright. So far, so good. I was expecting to see somewhere that I could drop a portal. No. Not yet. Yep, yeah, that's what I thought. That's not there yet. <sighs> okay. That looks like a fall to the death. That looks like a fall to the death. What am I missing? It's clearly none of the paint or whatever that lets you shoot a portal over there. Hmm. <laughs> I wonder. Alright, let's do this. Let's head back a little bit. Any way to get a, uh... Yeah, so let's go like that. Right? And then let's go like that. <laughs> there we go. And then we'll drop a blue portal that way. And go... Whoop, and bounce. And there we go. Nice. Alright. So that's gonna go there. Where's the next bit gonna go? Nope. Nope. Okay. If you're hearing this, it means <laughs> you're taking a long time on the catwalks between tasks. The lab boys say that might be a fear reaction. I'm no psychiatrist, but coming from a bunch of eggheads who wouldn't recognize the thrill of danger if it walked up and snapped their little pink bras, that sounds like protection. They didn't fly into space, storm on a beach, or bring back the gold. No, sir, we did. It's you and me against the world, son. I like your grit. Hustle could use the work, though. Now let's solve this thing. All right, so, uh, yeah, our hustle has been insulted, and we are in a new testing chamber. We've got the cube and some more of the bouncy stuff and some of the water, and I'm running up near the end of the time I've got available, but let's, let's give it a shot. Okay. So this is clearly one of those, uh, that needs to be there until it's not. How am I going to get you out of that thing? That can I give us anything useful? Oh. <laughs> well, I guess that works. Catch that. There we go. All right. So far, so good. All right. question. Why is that up there? 
Okay. Hmm. Is that bounce going to get me anything good? Or is this going to be a staged thing? Like, uh... figure out what point this gets me what I'm looking for. No! No, 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 out, out, out. Okay. one of those things where I gotta figure out how to get there we go get the bounce the cube to bouncy off there we go why not why is so much of why not why not marry safe science that you love it so much in fact why not invent a special safety door that won't hit you on the butt on the way out because you are fired now you test subject you're doing fine yes you box your stop out the front door parking lot car goodbye So on that wonderful note of uh, safe science, thank you for joining along. If you're watching live on Twitch, that's it. I'm done for the evening. Uh, if you want to watch live, I stream on Thursdays at 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern. There's a link in the description below. If you haven't already helped the channel out, follow on Twitch and subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you'll get notified when I go live on Twitch and new episodes and other content gets posted on YouTube. You'll get the notifications there as well. Uh, I do more than just games revisit. I also do Minecraft, and I'm going to be adding some more stuff in the near future. So do please subscribe to both. Um, e even if you don't plan on going there all the time, subscribe. That helps the channel out. And uh, I'll see you next time. <laughs>